While searching for the witch Ciri had quarreled with, Geralt ran into an old friend, Kira Metz. The sorceress told the witcher about a masked mage. Ciri had seemed to take him shelter in his hideout. The witcher set off to find it, with Kira in tow. Ciri had never reached the elven mage, yet the wild hunt had. The ghostly retinue was one step ahead of Geralt, or so it seemed. The witcher felt that all was lost, until Kira gave him a new lead. The Crones of Crookback Bog. Take it easy. Oh no! What would she want this time? Am I not surprised? I'm not surprised. Of course there's a side quest. Help an old feeble woman. What's wrong? To their night blasphemers, pox taken, profane the shrine to Verna the Merciful. Shrine's gotta be repaired. Else Verna what? will take umbrage. Her cows will croak, the kitties will be covered in warts, and our dogs will get the mange. That's a lot of things happening because of a statue being, you know, pushed over. Warts and mange? Sounds dangerous. Fine, I'll help you. Who would actually knock this statue down, though? I mean, it's definitely a little bit scary to look at, but that's still rude to Done. destroy someone's God, stuff like that. To me. Someone to repair their shrines from this day on. Look, already got a trade. I'm a witcher. Restoring traditional roadside structures in wood? Just not my specialty. Fight evil. That's a witcher's calling. Mm -hmm. And vandals are worse than beasts. Are they? Are, are they really? Fine. I see any damaged shrines. I'll take care of them. Won't go out of my way, though. Nothing's out of the way in these parts. And the gods will guide ye. Awful. Lover of ladies here, like my video, share my video, leave your comments below because I just love talking to you guys. But most importantly, please subscribe to the channel. That way you'll be able to get daily gaming content from me. And hit that notification button as well so you know when I upload my videos. You can also catch me on Twitch at loveroflady69. I can tell he has enough of this as it is. And look what at them trying want? to gang up on him. Wanna for talk to the Peller. To for Red. what? We've got dibs on a chat with him. A long one. Really? A long one? That's so cute. What do you want from him? To give him what he deserves. Alright. He done conjured algories. Said something evil had made its nest in Edric's bowels. Told Edric to eat rowan berries, lots of them. Ever since Edric's lived in the outhouse. And he's got hardened postures all over him. Wow, that's crazy. So they think he did it, so they're gonna go and kill him? It just so happens I need the Peller alive. So if you agree to leave him alone, for good, I'm willing to tell you how to help Edric. Hmm. Deal? Well, all in all, yes or no. Is it a deal or not? Fine. Let's hear it. Thank you. A tea of mullen leaves for his belly. And cover his boils with mallow. A few days and he'll be good as new. Noted. But if it don't work, we'll be back. And I'll be seeing you. Move out, boys. See, no need for bloodshed or fights. That's exactly what I want. Hmm. Gotta wonder about a man who could get Edric's friends all worked up. This is crazy. Let me in. Oh, hey, puff. Anybody home? And puff and huff and blow this house down. Open up, it's safe now. Devils. Who do they bring? What seek ye? I need your help. Oh, a man. Nay, a wolf. Grey, though not old. Tis he the pillar awaits. So this is the man I need to talk to? With chicken feet all over his chest? expecting me I as the bones declared I should 
They shall come whose stench is ripe and death. Damn. The wolf shall disperse them, the white wolf. And thus he comes. Omens never lie. So I'm the white wolf. That's really cute. Recognize this. Made of spruce wood, strong smell of juniper, designed to protect someone. Freshly cut spruce sprinkled with goat's blood, then tempered with an incense of earth smoke and juniper. For Anna, to protect her. Protect her from what, though? You make the amulet? Aye, sure it was the Pella. After the way of his forefathers over still water in the light of a full moon. Proper as amulets go. It protected well. Should never have taken it off. But my thing is, from what? So, designed to protect her. From what? Oh, the dear. Besieged she was. Evil all around, wanting to possess her. Old magic born of oblivion. From dark sources emerged. Old magic? Can you be more specific? It is not for mouth speech, nor for the touch. A small protective charm. Not a thing more a Pella could do. Hmm. He's very vague in general with his reasoning for making that for Anna. But magic, though. You mean to tell me that they ran off because someone put a curse on them? Anna and her daughter are missing. Know where they are? Nay. No, nay. Pella don't know. Are you sure? Don't lie to me, old man. Could know. The Pella will augur, the spirits ask. Spirits? Great. Fine with me. Long as I know where to look, where to find them. Lost, lost, must be found. Princess! None better than princess for finding things. Princess? Which princess? Princess, my goat! She's fled. What? Those men must have scared her off. Can we get back to the auguring? Without the goat, impossible. Wow. No goat <laughs> won't work. Wow. All for a goat. <sighs> Will you help me if I bring the goat back? Princess, princess, where have you got to, girl? I guess you have to. Fine, I'll get your goat. The bell. The little bell's ringing. She loves it. Ring, ring, and she will follow. Look for a while. But beware of wild strawberries. Raspberries, too. Yeah, treacherous as beasts go. I always keep an eye out for them. You have a new quest item. Prepare it for use by placing it in an appropriate slot in the inventory panel, then selecting it from the quick access menu. To use the item, press or hold R1. Got it. I cannot believe I am in the woods finding a goat named Princess. And I'm running, I'm running a bell too. Oh, snap. Hold on. Let's go. There's so many wolves here. This is not good. Come here. Now, <laughs> if Princess is in the middle of the woods, what makes you think she's not dead already? This is crazy. If these wolves are willing to attack me, imagine what they'll do to the goat. All right, come on. Where you at, goat? Princess. Wait, what? Oh, I hear her. I hear you, baby. This way, I think. Oh, I hear you. Come here. There you are. Princess. Here, Seriously? Goat. Here, princess. Come on, princess. Horned. Should have known it would be stubborn. This is one of the funniest right. quests. Try the bell. 
I am in. Let's go see the pillar. Come on, go. Should have guessed as much. What's a witcher compared to a patch of wild strawberries? Hilarious. So hilarious. The go is pretty cute too. Come on, damn it. Come on, Why princess. Bringing this bell for you to follow. Yeah, you have to. She is so ADD with things. Come on, go. Come on, baby. Come, princess. Where the hell did you go? Damn it, princess. Why? Come here. What? Why are you in here? Cut it out. Oh, you Run, stupid. stupid. Oh, Lord. Okay. You like that silver. The fact that this go led me to a bear. Are you serious right now? All right. Do I really have to keep ringing this bell for you to follow? Come on, princess. Don't ever... Leave by my side like that ever again. This is too much work. I don't even get paid enough to goat sit you. I really don't. I'm gonna ring the bell the whole time. Come on, princess. Your owner's waiting for you. This goat almost got me killed. And that was a big, massive bear. I'm so happy I, I know what to do when it comes to animals because this, this ain't it, you know? Yeah, yeah, I know. I know you're here. Come on, princess. You're no roach, but I bet we can be friends in time. You've got that all-important quality every roach has to have. You don't talk much. You are so funny, Gerald. Oh, look at that. He's here. We're inside, princess. Flee not from the pillar, for there are wolves about. <laughs> goat of mine, dearest, sweetest goat. I am so done with this. Like a goat named Princess runs away to probably stuff her belly with strawberries and raspberries. Can we talk about Anna and Tamara now? Know where they might be? Blood. We need blood. What? Living being. Are you serious? I got you the goat. Now you want more stuff from me? Are you stalling? Fine. Be right back. And if so, why are you stalling? Ooh, that goat is being fed. Will Got it. Do? Is he starting already? Okay. I'm gonna trust the process. I'm going to question it, but I'm going to trust the process. Poor rat. That is so scary, I'm not gonna lie. A child that lives not, yet did not die. What does that mean? It's over? Is that it? That is it. Spirits had nothing more to say? Like where they went or where they are now? You came for an augury, an augur I did. They're gone, the child remains. What child though? Mentioned a child. Whose? Why, Anna's. Anna was pregnant? She was. And she miscarried. Oh, no. Baron didn't mention it. Afraid, perhaps. 
or ashamed or forgetful. Or perhaps he had no wish to remember. Anna tell you all this? Did she come here after it happened? Nay, not Anna. It was the omens told me. Oh, right? wow. So I can the be spirits. sure it's true. The omens need not your faith to be true. It is you who needs the omens to lead you to truth. The Baron have anything to do with his wife's miscarriage? Foul-tempered he is, and he's a fondness for hooch. No doubt makes his temper even fouler. Did he abuse his family? Anna came to you, you must have noticed something. The Pella's old, near blind. But Princess came and licked her hand. So what? She's a wise beast. Only comes to those who suffer. Oh no, don't tell me that. So, my theory is she must have miscarried because she possibly could have had a fight with Baron. What happened to the child? In a grave thrown, without rite or ceremony, it awoke. Now it wanders, it seeks vengeance. A botchling. White wolf, wise wolf, catch the botchling. The botchling will help lead the wolf to the loved ones. Botchlings suck the blood of pregnant women and eat their fetuses. They don't help. Tis a being cursed, and witches lift curses. If the white wolf can't lift it, he should bring me its blood. Blood will always find kindred blood. Heard of one witcher who lifted a botchling's curse. Never tried it myself, though. I have a good I feeling. It under the threshold. We're gonna need to do name. that. Perform the I'm Roin. The ritual of naming. That's an elven custom. Human, elven, dwarven, ancient. Spirits have no race. They honor not its meaning. Win a spirit's favor, and the spirit shall aid you. Ask, and it will answer. Seek, and it will show you the way. Why do you want its blood? Blood, blood, blood. It binds men for all ages, the living and the dead. Sure, but what do you want to do with it? At times, a century is too short for two brothers to reconcile. One dies before things are set right. The other then brings his blood to the Pella. Mm -hmm. And what does the Pella do? He awaits forefathers' eve. He mixes the blood with milk, herbs, Ew. and hen's feet. He drinks. Ew! To reconcile the dead with the living. There Bloody shall be milk. No forefathers' eve this year. But we'll find a way, all the same. That is a wild ass drink to do. I I don't know. I don't know. Whatever I do, I gotta find the botchling first. Seek it at midnight, near the grave that lies empty. If what you say is true, the Baron ought to know where that grave is. Man, this is crazy. A miscarriage, and they bury the fetus in the ground like some garbage. This is getting wild. Strike. What the hell? The house is on fire? The castle is on fire. Oh no, this is bad. And it's no coincidence either. How much you want to bet? That's karma right there. For Baron being responsible for his wife's miscarriage. Oh no, this is bad. This is bad. Move! 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 Get out! Get out the way! Excuse me. Oh, this is bad. Baron! Where is this fool? Faster. How bad is it? Wow, the whole barn is in flames. Oswin, where's Oswin? Anyone seen him? Believe I saw him heading to the stable. What? Fire? You blind? Nobody willing to put it out? Ain't that simple? Most are afraid. Baron flies into a rage. He takes no prisoners. My brother's in the stable. We've got to save him. He'll burn alive. Him and the horses. See what I can do. Hurry now, quick! I got you. Oh, this is bad. Okay. So, let me see here. This would be... 
Telekinetic Blast. That would be good. Oh, look at the Baron. Drunk as ever. Okay. Blast. Right here. Nope. Can't even go through. How am I supposed to do this? Right here, right? Looks like rain. Damn it's it. locked. Probably bolted on the inside. Need another way in. The ladder, right here. I'm gonna make sure he gets saved because honestly, no one should be stuck here. I'll take all of that and thank you so much. Oh, this is bad. Where's the... I don't even see the brother. I got you! Are you here? I... It's okay. It's okay. Where you at? Okay, I got you. Where you at? Where's the brother? I hope I've managed to save him because I just couldn't find him in the flames. Okay, so I got the horse out. <laughs> We've a hero in our midst. You've earned yourself a barrel of Lyrian. I know your wife miscarried. Was that before or after you beat her to a pulp? Damn. What are you suggesting? Don't you heard me. You'd been beating them for years. Finally, they'd had enough and fled. Sound about right? Oh, great! Now I gotta fight him? Come on, man. Come on, Baron. No. No. Get out of my way, fool! Come on, Baron! There you go. You wanna beat up people, huh? How's it feel to get beat? Now go get sober and fix yourself, you pathetic fool. We need to talk. Are you done being a drunk ass? Your barn's in flames. Someone almost got killed. And you're over here being drunk out of your mind. Pathetic. Sit down. You beat them. I never laid a finger on Samara. Not once. But your wife. Not Anna. That's another story. Of course it is. She always knew how to spark my ire. Expect me to believe you were a loving father to Tamara after that scene in the courtyard? You're free to believe whatever you wish, but she was always the apple of my eye. She had the run of the place. Ask anyone. She'd ride the horses, hunt with the men, at times join them on their rounds. And they'd send for her when I flew into a rage, for only she could calm me. Make it sound like she led a charmed life. If that's the case, why'd she run? Speak. I'd hardly need you if I knew. Your wife, how'd she make you angry? Too much salt in the soup? Socks never darned? Twenty years we've known each other. She's seen me drunk and sober. She was there to greet me when I returned the victor. She was there to patch me up in defeat. Like no other, she knew where to press, where to pinch, so it would hurt. So beating her was a solution? For, that, for criticizing you? Pathetic oh, scumbag. Witcher, you haven't a clue, have you? Well, perhaps I shall tell you about it one day. One day, but not today. You knew they had run away from the start. Yes, I knew. So why didn't you why be didn't up front me? with me? Wasted my time. Exactly. Say, I had. Say I'd said I had troubles. Couldn't control my wife, my daughter. What kind of flaccid prick would you take me for? Tell me everything you remember about the day they fled. The truth this time. Be honest, Baron. Help I've me to help you. I myself three days straight. 
Anna came to me, said they were leaving. I begged them to stay. She refused to hear it. I tried to stop her. She wriggled like an eel. We struggled. She fell. Last blasted thing I remember. Woke up in the morn, breeches heavy with my own piss. A large bump on my head. Sadly, they were gone. Know what that's like, Witcher? No. How the fuck could you? I was left with nothing. Nothing! Only the bottle. Tomorrow present for all this, she see you quarrel. Through the doorway, perhaps. Wow. She didn't enter the room. Shame, too. Things might have turned out differently. The sight of her always calmed me. If only he knew that the daughter hated him. I mean, remember the poem that we read the last episode? Oof. Signs of a fight in the room. Hole in the wall, wine all over the landing. Was that you? Oi. We tussled. She tried to whack me on the noggin with a candlestick, but kept missing. Hit the wall and the pillar instead. I staggered backwards onto the table, spilled the wine, slipped and tumbled. Anna used that moment to flee. She rushed down the stairs, still clutching that damn candlestick. I caught her on the landing. We fell. I, I thought I had her. Then she turned and smacked me in the head. I blacked out. Don't know what happened next. When I came to, I was alone. What happened next? Next? It only got worse. I awoke at sunset, not knowing how many days had passed. Thought it was all a plowing, drunken nightmare. And then I went to the bedchamber, and Anna was not there. Instead, there was blood everywhere. I knew she'd miscarried. My breath short, my throat locked. I neared the bed. And saw so it. It lay there. What? A tiny thing. Defenseless. On bloody sheets. Dead. And it was my doing. Maybe you're doing, maybe not. But that amulet she wore could be important. Or maybe the fact that she lost it. What did you do with a child? Where is it, Baron? What was I to do? Took it out and buried it. Just like that? Damn you! I gave no thought to a funeral. It was a horror. I wanted it to end. That child had been my dream. I told Anna, the little one, our little one, to make things right. Yet she died before she could be born. Understand, Witcher. My child was dead. I sympathize. I do. Thank you. And know that I hope you find your Siri. Deal we made means I need to find Tamara and Anna first. Just so happens your unborn daughter might help us do that. What? How? Sometimes miscarried fetuses, if they don't get a proper burial, turn into botchlings. Into... fucking what? A cursed creature that draws strength from killing pregnant women. Once it's strong enough, it attacks those who scorned it. But how, hey, you have that issue. How does it know? Blood ties. They're a strong bond. A bond I want to use to find your family. How? One of two ways. Legends claim you can bury a botchling under the family's threshold, perform a ritual, and turn it into a lubberkin. That's a sort of, uh, hob. A guardian spirit that could lead me to your family. Or the other way. We kill it and draw some blood. Take that to the Peller and he does the rest. Do not kill my child. It's suffered enough already. Lift the curse that it may finally rest in peace. Okay, so we'll go with the first option then. Still not sure what to do. 
Whatever you decide, we must put an end to my child's suffering. Whatever we do, we gotta find the botchling first. I'll show you where I buried her, and I'll dig the grave at my threshold. If okay. it turns out we can't transform the botchling into a lubberkin, they can bury us in it. Handy either way. The sooner we resolve this, the better. Best do it tonight, at midnight. Then wait here with me. Near midnight, I'll take you to where I buried her. Appreciate Get your assistance. Ought to stay in their homes tonight and draw a line of salt outside their doors. No interference. And try to sober up. That's too like burn. A shovel to dig up the grave. Take yes. it. You'll need it, but not for that. So we are heading to the graves where he buried the further. fetus. Follow me. Okay. Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next week.